Sudan, Mr. Tutu Stephen Youssef, to kindly elucidate us on sustainability and higher education globally. Over to you, sir. to Stephen Yusuf from the Republic of South Sudan. It's an honor to be here today to attend the sixth Asia African Development Conference. It's my first time to come to India and when I was given the opportunity to come, it took me time decide but thank God I'm here today. Uh, indeed the sustainability of higher education globally plays a very great role in our lives. India particularly takes a great credit in higher education, provision to many other continents, and particularly Africa and South Sudan especially. South Sudan have the opportunity to have high number of students coming to study in India and they go back when they are well educated. And that role played by India and other nations in providing opportunities in higher education create a foundation for sustainable peace globally. As we all know, that when people meet in the name of education globally, they tend to create synergy, they tend to, to work together, and as they go back, it creates the alumni group, where they can be able to discuss how to bring peace in one nation or the other. Of course, education in the modern society plays a great role in creating peace individually in our societies. Without education, you find it very difficult for people to be able to understand one another. And that's a role that a higher education plays in our lives, that we're able to understand to live together with each other as we meet at at different education levels. Today, in the contemporary world, education has gone into modernization. There is specialized education that is now pulling up the youth together in technology, in medical fields, and where you realize different nationalities are able to work in different countries to be able to put things together, how to advance the world forward. For instance, yesterday in the plane I met a gentleman from South Africa and he was heading to India, specifically coming to do a software program and you can realize how higher education is able to bring nationalities together, work together to understand the current issues and be able to provide solutions to the global issues. 
Not forgetting the most important thing that we need to do in higher education globally. I understand that many people come from the African continent to India and other Asian world for education. But I would like also to take this opportunity that why don't these Asian countries take the education closer to, to the African continent? Why do I say this? Of course, the, 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 the scholarship that is provided at higher high education is not enough for many students who have the need to study higher education. And to me, I believe higher education should be an opportunity for every citizen, cuts across every society, because it is the basic foundation for our lives. And every individual must be able to attain a higher education. And to attain that, we need to provide means so that every individual interested in school is able to attain that. There are many students within the African continent very much interested to be able to join higher education but they are not able to join. I take this challenge back to the Asian world and other nationalities who are here that also look forward to be able to put up higher education within the African continent that can be able to offer very easier accessibility to other students who have the needs to study. Of course, sustainability in higher education has come with a lot of specialization in the modern world. And that is why today we can upload Indian for attracting so many people coming to India specifically for medical purpose. When you go right now and do an, an, an assessment within India, you realize there are many people who have come to India because of the specialization that India has taken upon themselves in higher education, particularly in the medical field. This has attracted so many so many people uh, coming in for that specialized services. And of course, these are also some of the services that we expect to be able to reach other continents, and particularly Africa, so that uh, the, 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 the kind of specialization and the skills that you have in those areas we are able to tap on them. Um, this can happen through exchange program among universities that I believe uh, exist in some of the African universities. I encourage some of the Indian institutions to be able to come down and be able to agree some memorandums with these African universities to be able to work together to ensure that higher education is sustainable uh, globally. Uh, with these few remarks, I would like to give a great appreciation for this a very important conference that has brought people from different uh, walks of life and we are here to discuss very important issues that does not only touch the life of Indian communities or the Asian world, but also other continents. So we give you a very high credit for looking ways of how to help other continents to be able to achieve uh, the level of education that can 
make development happen, that can make peace happen. Uh, thank you very much for giving me this opportunity.